Greetings, Internet. Callisto here from ProGaming-Tips.com. Alright, the Internet has requested that I do a commentated team deathmatch thing, and I would like to keep the Internet appeased, so, uh, here it is, my, uh, commentated team deathmatch thing. The first thing you're going to want to do when you load up a team deathmatch server is just kind of figure out what the flow of the game is, see how the noobs are playing, which spots they're rushing, which spots they're camping in. Instead of getting like all super aggressive and just jumping in and getting dick raped in two seconds. So basically what I'm doing here is I'm just scoping out the map, seeing how far in they are and what kind of spots they're playing. What I'm doing right here is using my team to bottle up the other guys on their spawn. And if they want to get out of their spawn, they're going to have to come through this way. So I'm just going to camp here and wait for a few stray guys to try and make it out through this hole. Well, that strat didn't work out so great. A bunch of them ended up getting by at the same time. So now I've got to push ahead and clean up that mess before they get behind us and cause a noob fairy tale. After I pick up those two string kills there, I want to move to a different part of the map because I don't want two people just like dedicated to getting revenge on me. So I'm just going to go ahead and move to the other side of the map and then let them fight my teammates while they're looking for me. I don't usually go after knife kills, but when I was fighting this guy here, I ran out of ammo, so I just decided to use his skull as a knife holder. So I get kind of gayed right here by Shooty McShootenstein, but uh, you know, it's important to be able to handle your deaths in any game, not just COD 4. So I'm not just going to sit here and call this guy a hacker, or bitch about how shitty the game is, even though I do do that a lot, just not in this circumstance. But uh, you just got to figure out what killed you. Like what killed me right there is I got prone blocked, so I'm just not going to play that spot anymore when I try and watch that doorway. So just learn from your mistakes instead of just bitching people out or calling hacks. This map's a lot more open than vacant, so I like to play it a little bit faster and more aggressive. And just like before, I'm not just rushing headlong into the orange dots on my minimap. I'm trying to get an idea of where they are. I see like a lot of them grouped up in that one area over there so I'm slowly working my way across around the map so that I can hit them from the flank and have a better chance at getting a lot of kills instead of just rushing in head first get one kill and then get raped by 12 guys Always got to keep an eye open for gay shit like claymores, and then once you set one off, always got to be uh, aware that like people set those, they're not just left there by the map, so you got to expect that if you set one off that there's going to be a guy waiting for you somewhere. Friendly 
This might sound kind of weird, but I don't like playing with my team in Team Deathmatch for a few reasons. For starters, I don't like having a lot of people around me because that's what people are looking for when they get like airstrikes and pre-nades, so if you separate yourself from the rest of the team, they're going to end up having to deal with the airstrikes and you'll usually be alright. Plus, I don't want them shooting early and then giving away my spot on the map or blocking me or just a bunch of bullshit. I would rather just play on my own because I'm confident enough that I can take on a few guys if they pop out of nowhere. Alright, internet. I hope you found this guide helpful. My site and book are in the description. Check that out. I will see you guys next time.